reaction. Yeah, um, it's, it's not like the fastest reaction, but actually yeah. he showed it to me right there. He can react to it very fast. So going right into game one on Battlefield. And uh, Villager is Light Work, and Death Force is the Mewtwo. And Light Work has to be really careful with how we use projectiles, because obviously the obviously a Mewtwo has to confusion. Oh, yeah. It's the thing, you, you won't really be able to catch uh, a Mewtwo jumping with a back air or something like that, because no. Mewtwo's love to oh, jump. Ooh. ooh. He went he went for that Abadongo uh, footstool. I yeah. think Villager might be a little bit too short, though. Yeah, I think it might be a little difficult on uh, thing, and I don't think he was in kill percent yet at that point, especially on Battlefield. But uh, you know, maybe he knows better. And I thankfully, think was, yeah, it was just to show light work that yo, know, yo, know, I can do that to you if I want to. Yeah, you know what true. I mean. Twenty-seven percent on Death Force. Yeah, and Lightwork is just struggling to get in right now. Yeah, he's he's definitely utilizing that uh, that uh, side B correctly. Yeah, <laughs> not <laughs> even allowing to get in. Up, I don't know if up throw will kill quite yet though. Oh, 40. Oh, look, that will, though. Yeah, he suspect all the way. Yeah, in, yeah. Sus suspect EI. But Death Force, that, that first talk was really clean for him. Yeah, really you know, good. in the first like 10 seconds, they're already building 50%. Yep. And then already, another another string. Another string almost lapped in the percent. He's looking almost unwinnable for a yeah. villager. You know? Just I now understand why people say Mewtwo wins his matchup. Yeah. 4 there. Yeah, Lightwork hasn't done anything like, remotely close to like a good string land. A lot of chip damage, a lot of a lot of slingshots, but nothing. But like, you know, nothing, nothing really that that kind of long. Yeah. And Death Force right now, he's definitely. I, I don't think he's taken any damage in a while. Actually, like, he's no. definitely. Oh, jab up to. Well, that was a very good reaction to He jabs the wrong way and then immediately yeah. turns around and does the other jab. That's one thing I don't see too many players do often, you know, is that they'll, they'll miss the first jab and then just kind of... Or like, yeah, just yeah. in general, just like quick, doing quick turnarounds at yeah. the same place, you know? Okay. People, they'll, they'll, they'll try and dash or something, but they won't just... If, if they see someone on the other side, they react immediately, just turn around and just jab or grab, you know? I think most people... Opt oh, wow. Ooh, wow. That was close. He was re really reaching for that. I think most people opt to, like, roll away if they miss an yeah. attack in that yeah. situation. People usually choose a defensive option, but choosing yeah. the right offensive option there can definitely be beneficial. Okay, light work putting out some damage here. That actually might have killed. Yeah. Four air, and that was it. Yeah. Death Horse taking that. Very, very dominating first game. That first stock was, he, he looked untouchable that first stock. Yeah. And uh, I believe both of these uh, players are solo mains. You know, they don't have. Uh, I have never seen Lightwork move anyone else. Yeah. I think yeah. I've seen him use like Mario and like oh. friendlies. Oh, right. Oh. And right there, I, I heard Corrin. I heard Corrin, so he's gonna go uh, out the that's probably That's probably uh, light work. Yeah. As soon as we say the actual secondaries. Yeah, I know. I, I, I've, I've never seen the secondary. I've never seen Lightwork play another character. You know, maybe in his home region of Windsor. Yeah. He does it. But, uh, you know, now you're going to see a different playstyle coming from Death Horse, you know? You know, last matchup, he could play very aggressive. You know, not doesn't really have to camera shadow about something back because, yeah. you know, he runs the risk of that getting pocketed. But now he can play very defensive. Yeah. You know, take his time, throw shadow balls, and yeah. slowly build percent. This corner has nothing to, to counter. Yeah. Definitely doing a bit better at this match than he was the first match of Villager. Very, very good spacing from, uh, from Lightwork. I almost called him Let's Tickle. <laughs> I almost called him Let's Tickle. Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> I saw, I saw, um, because I don't know. It's, it's Corrin and they both, they're both their names start with L. Yeah, yeah, definitely, definitely. And even uh, Let's Tickle, he uses his tag as LT sometimes. LT, yeah. And it's, and, so it can be a little confusing, yeah, I definitely understand. Lightwork has the LW. You know, uh, Lightworks, you know, Corrin already doing better than his Villager. Villager, yeah. I don't think a Tipper Forge Smash might actually kill from, from Corrin. Yeah, that, it's actually very strong, though, so it, it actually might possibly. Forward air, not quite enough to kill yet. Oh, that will kill him. First stop, going to Death Horse. Only 64% on him. Yeah, Death Horse is, like, very accurate with his Corrin airs. Like, yeah. He's been landing a lot of them. That's what it's looking like he's in complete control of this match right now. Right now. And I'm like, you know, that Horse is staying very unpredictable. Like, he's not uh, playing telegraph at all. Yeah. Like, Lightwork is not able to find a way in and, and try and read his playstyle at all. Because I can't. Oh. oh. Okay. Yeah, Death Horse, he's, sometimes he's approaching with Nair. Sometimes he's just empty hopping. Sometimes he's approaching with, like, short hop forwarders. Yeah. I'm like, the combo coming from Lightwork, actually. Up throw. Uh, not yet. Oh, oh okay. Cool. Oh, he aired on. Yeah, for yeah. a split second, I thought that actually killed him. I think the next one might do it, though. Yeah, normally you see uh, Corrin's go for the down throw first. But uh, that time. 
And he's gonna taunt, you know, get himself pumped. <laughs> get himself pumped up. Yep. Yeah, only 13% on light work. Definitely doing better this match than he did in the first game. Yeah. And you can already hear the Windsor boys behind him. Yep. Trying to pump him up, trying to motivate him to definitely do well, because yeah. if he takes this game, it'll be 1-1. One, one, and I don't know if this would be considered an upset if they were to, to, win, were to win, but it, it definitely yeah. seems like it would a really good. It, it would be a big turnaround, yeah. Oh! I thought that was game. Like, <laughs> wow, both, game. both players making aggressive options. He, he dares yeah. him and tries to up smash, but then Lightwork pulls out a dare of his own yeah. again. My god, Lightwork is just going off right now. Yeah, definitely very good uh, pivot grab coming from him. They were definitely showing us stuff here. Nice spot yeah. dodge. Oh, he hit the platform. The oh, the oh, the tip! Goodness. Oh, got the tip or side. He wasn't enough to kill, though. I definitely thought that was going to kill. Yeah, so did I. He's trying to space out with back airs right now. Down throw. Down. Oh, oh, no. Yeah, Good at, time, at times like that, you know, he, has, he hasn't been mashing out before, so yeah. he definitely missed it up. Up and air, up that air. is it. Death Horse taking that 2-0 oh, with, the, with the little mini pop-off as well. Yeah, he because he definitely knew that, you know, that corn was on another level compared to that first stock was kind That first stock was kind of it, but he picked it up, like, immediately after. Yeah, honestly, Lightwork doing an amazing job.